Hello YouTube! This is Marina. Today I make a video um, to show you guys my prayer slash spiritual journal. I got many ideas on YouTube. Many ladies showed their journals. Um, one lady in particular, Gina Garland, she's very inspiring. She sent it a package well, she emailed a package if you requested um, to get instruction on how to set up your prayer journal. It was very structured and very organized, very, very organized. I made mine a little personalized, special for me. And I just want to share this with you guys. So, um, Gina Garland used a small um, ring binder. I like the big one and I found this one at Staples in the clearance section for three dollars. Most of my supplies um, I already had. I have uh, school age children so we have a lot of loose leaf papers and uh, sheet protectors and tabs. So but yes so here's my my own prayer journal. Everybody can make their own journal and this is mine so I'll share this with you guys again I use stickers just to decorate it I love to get stickers from Walmart anywhere first I always keep a stack of loose leaf paper in my binder just to be ready to write down and then I have some spare dividers with tabs And Gina Garland started also, the first section is Almighty God. This is all about God. Praise God. Praise His name. And just uplift the Lord. And you can see here, G-O-T-T, -T, that's Gott in German, that means God. I'm German. <laughs> so... Almighty God. This is all about God. For example, like I said, you can do your personalized um, journal the way you want it. I started off with lyrics from songs that I like. Be before you pray and when you uplift God, you might find it easy to start singing. You might want to sing your favorite worship song and I have some lyrics that I really enjoy that I really like Above All Kingdom and really different lyrics that I found for me and next page ah, it's a little shining um, it's a song called Awake. This is one of my favorite songs. Then names for God. Those are all kinds of names for our God. Just throw them on our construction paper and put them in the sheet. Here's more names. Alpha author of our faith, author of our life, chief shepherd, good shepherd, God, gentle whisperer, father, you might hear something, that's my little doggy. Hey Bella, say hi. <laughs> She's making a video with me. Um, here are the bibli biblical names for God. Those are the same ones over here. These are just with um, where to find them in the Bible. So for each name for God, there is a scripture and where to find it in the Bible. So it's like from A to C and I found those on the web and I just printed them out. And then some more songs. Hillsong, Oceans, Casting Crows, 
Michael W. Smith. So this is all about praising God and just tell him how much you love him and just a one-on-one -on -one with God. And then I printed this one out. Um, it says, whenever you feel unloved, unimportant or insecure, remember to whom you belong. I like this one, so I put that in here too. And then the next tab in my journal is all about me. All about Marina. Also, I put stickers again. You can decorate it whatever way you like it. Put little stickers on. And I just basically put it together, so I didn't really have anything in this section yet. But here I would put everything about me. Like, I'm a mother, I'm a friend, I'm a daughter, sister in Christ. And just put your prayers in here for everything that you pray for yourself, that you want to talk to God about. And then the next section is my children. My lovely children, Brittany and Jason. I pray for my children every day, many times a day. Gina Garland, she sent it a, in the package, it came with a prayer calendar for mothers. I like this one especially. It, it shows you all kinds of um, sections to pray for your children. Love, faithfulness, self-control. Love for God's word, justice, kindness, purity, everything, faith, courage. Okay, and then the next section is my boyfriend. I pray for him. I pray for his safety, for his health, for our relationship. That is this. And then I guess if you married, of course, this would be a section for your husband. Then the next section is my mother. Mama in German. <laughs> my mom is in Germany and I miss her really much. She's very important to me. And it's very important for me that I pray for my mom every day. And again, I just decorated with stickers and love mom and her boyfriend. The next section is my pets, which one of them is sleeping over there <laughs> with her stuffed animal. <laughs> this is my chihuahua, Bella. My cat Ramses and Horace, and I pray for their health, safety, and they part of my family, so I pray for them also. And then I will. I want to make some more section for praying for my friends, co-workers, and then another section praying for government and authorities and leaders to make wise, healthy and good decisions for the country, for us. I think it's very important that we pray for our leaders. Now the next section is my sermon notes. Notes that I take while I'm at church. And while I'm at church I use a little notebook and I just write while I'm in there you can see it's scribbled in I gotta write fast and um, and then when I get home everything that I find important I write down and put it in this section my sermon notes I have many of these and also flyers that I get 
from church that match to the service. I just glue them in here. So I have a lot of these. So I'm going to just stick this. And the next section that I have is my Bible study. Can I just cut out an old postcard and just decorate it? By the way, these um, colorful papers that I have, um, I think I have a nice one right here that I use for my page. I went to Joann's and they had like six sheets of paper of any color that you like in any style and design I think they were a dollar a dollar or a dollar ninety nine I think so you just cut it cut them up and just make them fit in here make it look pretty so that's my Bible study so anything that I want to learn about or know about like science symbols anything words, find the definition, the meaning for it. I put that all in here. Any Bible study that I do, I'm in a woman's group right now and we do um, a Bible study. So I would put all this in this section in here. Prayers that I like. Um, yeah, I was reading up on the Old Testament I have a few pages of that and then about the New Testament so those are just examples now the women's group that I'm in we're talking about fear right now and how to connect it with God like if you have fear and stuff so that's the subject on the group that I'm doing right now so just, you know, if I see something that I like, I cut it out, little pictures. Yes, and then I have some more papers here. And in this section I have some private thoughts and dreams. Any, any thoughts or dreams that I have that I find important, that I want to not forget about, so I write them down and put them in this section. And then just I have like more uh, church flyers and stuff like that. So again, um, this is your own. You can make this your own personal, personal, like a diary, I would say, just for you and God. And everyone's is unique. It's perfect. And it's your alone time with God. And any time when you glue a picture and if you write a verse down, a prayer, that's spending time with God. And God loves every second that you spend with Him and for Him. So, and this is just a nice, fun way to do this. So, I hope this gave you guys a little idea on how I did my prayer spiritual journey journal I'm sorry and I hope it will inspire you to make your own if you have any questions please feel free to leave a comment for me and other than that um, I'm sending love and peace to everybody God bless you. Bye.